in Kunu at the moment? Indeed, I am in at Kunu. In fact, we're coming to you live from the Nelson Mandela Museum right here in Kunu, in the Eastern Cape, uh, the home of legends. And of course, if you count those legends, I'm sure the name of Mama Winnie Mandela will feature right at the top of that, uh, uh, among those uh, at the top of that list. And unfortunately, she's one of those legends we have just lost. However, for more reactions, you now have a pleasure of being joined by the first citizen of the province, Mr. Pumula Maswale. Say a very good afternoon to you and a warm welcome to this broadcast firstly your reactions to, to the news you personally no thank you very much uh, indeed it is a sad loss uh, to us as a province and of course to humanity as a whole she was uh, an outstanding uh, personality full of commitment dedication to the cause of the poor particularly rural women she is one of that illustrious generation uh, we pride ourselves in this province very militant, very resolute, and of course capable of telling anyone that which had to be said. We will always uh, uh, treasure the memory of the life that she lived. Born in this province, um, she's getting a national special funeral. Any plans as, for you as a province to try and commemorate his life, her life? Certainly, we will be joining uh, the national effort, of course, with a, sp a, sp a specific provincial uh, memorial service, which at the moment we are working on its modalities, but we're definitely going to situate it in Bizana, her birthplace, uh, so that uh, we could make uh, people really uh, celebrate the life uh, that she lived, which uh, shall always be an inspiration to many to come. I understand that uh, it's a, she's someone that uh, you also knew personally. I, I also knew her personally, yes, uh, because uh, as a mother, uh, and of course as a citizen, a first citizen in the province, from time to time uh, she would uh, call in uh, to find out this or that. There is the last time we were having a conversa conversation was when there was a blockade here in Kono. She was quite concerned I had to go and brief her. Upon telling her what was happening, she was the first to say, I buy a Moshanguk. And she was resolute to tell those who needed to behave when it was time to behave. She had passion for the people of this part of our province. She had passion for the province, but of course, passion for the African National Congress and the entire liberation effort. Oh, so she's someone who keep a keen interest in what was happening in the province and communicated with you as the first citizen. Is that Definitely. Uh, she always wanted to know what was happening. What bothered her was development in this area and she wanted to see that development reach the rural areas. She's very passionate about rural areas. It's always been a marvel to talk to her because she came across as very respectful, never coming down upon you in as much she was of such a stature but you always got the sense that there is respect for the authority Young as I am, I always enjoyed from her that much of respect. Sir, we understand that uh, you have another meeting to rush to. Thank you very much for thank your time. You, thank you, thank you. Well, that was the Premier of the province, uh, Mr. Pumula Maswale, outlining some of the things that have been said time and again about Umama Winnie Man Mandela and, of course, her ability to, sp to speak truth to authority. And, of course, he's here telling us uh, that uh, he was never spared uh, of that as well. However, he, she's, he's pointing out uh, that uh, all that was done uh, in a very, very respectful manner, of course, speaking to the kind of person uh, that Umama Winnie Mandela was. And We've spoken, of course, to some of the community members around here and they've expressed uh, some great sadness uh, at the news of her passing. And uh, some have gone as far as to express wishes uh, that uh, she may possibly be buried here. They say they, they would love to see that uh, coming here and uh, be buried right next to her former husband, Uma Utada, the late great uh, Utada Nelson, Holy Shasha Mandela. But we'll keep you posted on what will be happening here. You can tell that uh, a lot has happened. A big tree has fallen and there's a lot happening around here in Umtata. And of course our colleagues in Pizana are telling us uh, there's a lot happening on that side. As you have heard from the Premier from here, uh, they have confirmed that indeed as the province they will have a special memorial service for Mama Winnie Mandela and and that will happen at her birthplace of uh, Pizana. With that, allow us to wrap and hand back to you in Auckland Park.